Are you ready to enjoy an old classic video game? <laughs> that is right. Today, as you can see, this is a live view of my Nintendo 64. Let's go ahead and hit the start button and start the game of, you guessed it, because you saw the title and thumbnail, Banjo. Kazoo. What a classic video game that I know every single person has played, right, on the Nintendo 64. Everyone, everyone knows everything about this game, and everyone not like 4 is going to remember <laughs> this game exactly how it was, because I never played it. Check that out. Look at me, and Link's 4. I'm stretching. I know what I'm doing. Why is he even here? But right, here we go. This is Banjo. He has a Banjo. <laughs> and we have our normal, uh... Intro to the game. Very nice here. Cool. We got Kazooie. Everybody knows these guys. They appeared in Smash Brothers, I think. I haven't played it in a while, so did they actually get in the game? But okay, we got Crazy Tiki Man, officially licensed by Nintendo. You know this isn't some sort of ROM hack. You know this isn't some sort of port. Actually, this is a PC port. But anyway, it's still by Nintendo. As we enjoy. Probably copyrighted music, huh? You guys done? Oh. I think they are done. Wait. What just happened? Anyway, we're in our file select here. We haven't got anything. We have zero jiggies, zero notes, zero time. But we're on Spiral Mountain. Ooh, ooh. Kind of cool. So here we are playing as Kazooie. And since this is a PC port, they decided to add a first person to the game. I think there wasn't a first person in the original, right? I am completely lost and confused. But you know, continuing our journey, I think we got to go up there. Man, look at these PC graphics. The water is so realistic compared to the N64. Would you believe it? Oh, man. Amazing how far technology comes throughout the years, you know? Like, whoa. Anyway, got to jump up here. Come on, Kazooie, aren't you a bird? Shouldn't you be able to fly instead of just jump? Whatever. Oh, hey, it's uh, our good old friend, Banjo. How you doing, Banjo? Banjo? Please, don't turn off the game. I will not touch my N64. I just want to play. What a coincidence. Because me too. Let's go somewhere special. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for your special place, Banjo. Take me to your special place. Wait, what is this place? Mad Monster Mansion. Is this a... Whoa. Whoa. The sky. Uh, is this an actual Banjo place? Can I go in here? No? Okay. All the places are closed. Holy... I don't even want to look up. That's making me sick. All right, the heck is this place? This is the mansion. Maybe mad monsters are in here? Banjo. Oh, hey Banjo. What you doing over here, buddy? Banjo? Wanna play hide and seek? Uh. Uh. Is this the same exact thing that just happened? Banjo? Where'd you go, buddy? Am I playing the seeker or are you the seeker? You're not there anymore. Uh, well, I guess he's hiding and I'm seeking. I kind of expected the opposite since, you know, that's how it goes in Sonic.exe. I mean, PC port. Where are you at, Banjo? There's our, there's our picture right there. He has to be in here somewhere, right? Hello, buddy. Andrew. Oh, a puzzle piece. What? Crunchy furnace. Fu oh, God. Banjo. <laughs> uh, he's right behind me. <laughs> Jump. Hey, Banjo. Give me the... What? Oh, Kazooie went kasplatty. Huh? What the heck, man? Hello? What is this? 
Uh, you doing? Uh, is that my head? Am I dead? Then what am I right now? My head. What is going on here? How you been? Up to any good killing uh -huh. lately? What? You're just gonna laugh at me and then close the game? See you soon. Oh, see you soon. Oh my god, are you ready? A final delivery? Don't turn away, because just as always, bonus game is better than regular game, maybe. So we'll start a new game. A very interesting one called Final Delivery to Town Cemetery. I cannot leave before delivering the package. So I have a package and I have to deliver it to this cemetery. The sturdy gate was rusted shut a long time ago. Well, is there any way around this? Oh, I can go inside the bushes. Okay. We got to deliver our package. It is of utter importance. Okay. Hello. Where do I need to put this? Huh. The way is closed with a web of chains held in place with a padlock. So maybe we need to find a key? Why is there a floppy disk out here? Love, it's not a, huh? What? What? I'm very confused. I'm very com Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Package below this polygonal tomb. He held the key to much progress. Is this where the key is? I'm, I'm really confused by what these are trying to tell me. This is a strange place. The remains of the graveyard office. So the office doesn't open up anymore? Oh, I just walked in through the busted window. I set the package down in the mail area. I, I sense a, a feel a sense of loss. Why am I delivering the package here? Maybe I'll hold on to the package a little longer. Uh, okay, I'm really confused and I'm a little creeped out, not gonna lie. Uh, buried due to budget constraints? Game sure is a little bit, uh, creepy. Okay, I'm just gonna leave the package. Every time I put the package down, something makes a noise. I don't know what's making a noise. Maybe, oh, this opened up when I put the package. A package, ooh, secret, uh, secret pathway. Interesting. Okay, we got a key. I found a robust key. We already delivered a package, so we could technically leave. But do we want to leave? What secrets are in this graveyard? So this key goes to this fence right here. You'll unlock the change fall away. Okay. It's been sealed for some time with decaying planks. So is there a way into this tomb? Oh. Wow, a hefty hammer. How convenient just to find this. Let's destroy these planks even though we're not supposed to actually be doing this. If I'm going in here, I will need to take the package too. But hey, maybe that's where we have to deliver the package. Not actually into the office itself. Okay, one hammer, two package. We can switch between them if we need to. Butte Town Cemetery. Yo, the guy that I'm delivering this to is probably already dead. I don't think he minds if I don't deliver it, but whatever. I descend into the murk of the dusty tomb. Uh, great. Totally not creepy being in a tomb with nobody else. Not creepy at all. Okay, we got a hammer. Let's use this. Nice. Let no person walk forward towards the unholy horror with N. I'm a person though. Here we go. Not listening. La la la, I have my music in my ears, you know, can't hear a thing. <gasps> Stay away. <laughs> Stay away. Is there gonna be anything here? I'm definitely hitting it with my hammer. <laughs> Is this an infinite hallway? I don't know if I can see the end or if this is an infinite hallway. What if I bring the package? Package. 
Oh, it's totally an infinite hallway. Huh. Okay, so that's that's definitely interesting. Let no person walk forward. Toward? Walk forward? What if we go backwards? Is that a thing? Oh god. It's actually working. You gotta walk backwards towards the horror within. <laughs> Hello? Okay, we made it. That's so it. Oh god. Memory overwhelms. This place is both strange and deeply familiar. It is my home. My home? There's one empty prison. Here is where I will open the package. Open the package? I rip the package open to reveal its still beating contents. I draw sustenance from the warm living heart consuming it completely. I remember after some years away my identity suppressed. I have returned to my home and rediscovered my true self. What? <laughs> The graves and cages here are filled with the remains of my victims. Their flesh, my sustenance. Their pain, my joy. Their death, my eternal life. The end. We are playing as a cannibal, I guess. And this is where we go to eat them. Your hungry pal voxel. A little creepy. A little creepy, not gonna lie, but hopefully you will. Uh uh enjoyed it <laughs> don't get inspiration from it but anyways thank you all so much for watching links for